Levi, what's the main gun safety rule? Treat every gun as if it was loaded. And how do you do that? Keep your finger off the trigger until you're ready to shoot. Know your target and let's be on. Don't point at anything you aren't willing to destroy. That's right. Okay, you got your glasses and your earplugs on? Yes. Okay. Now what's the name of this gun? Scrounger. How come you call it Scrounger? You can fit in anything you can scrounge up. Oh, okay. He can shoot it if you fit it in. Okay, so there you shot a 22 and a 38 and a 12 gauge. The scrounger here is a five pound gun. Makes it very easy to carry. It's a single shot, it's very dependable. Um, first, I'm going to uh, shoot it as a muzzle loader. So I'm putting in my breech plug. Take my powder right here. Dump my powder down the barrel. This is Pyrodex, it's like black powder. Then I just have some wax paper for wadding. Leaves or anything would work. And this is my homemade ramrod out of some PEX plumbing and a screwdriver. Okay, now we'll take the slug and put the slug in on top of that wad. Pound that down. Carefully open up the back. Take our priming cap. Put in there like that. And then here we go. I'm going to shoot at the middle of the three-quarter cardboard there, or plywood. Okay, here we go as fast as we can. 22. 9mm. Went right through that can without moving it. 38 Special. Now all these have about the same power as if they were shot out of a uh, snub nose revolver. Three fifty seven. Look for this can up there. That was a miss. Uh, 45 ACP. Shoot for that middle target there again. Okay. Now we're going to go with the 45 Colt. I'll shoot at that middle target there again. Bullseye. Okay, 44 Magnum. I'm going to shoot at the target to the left in the middle. Just below. Okay, once in a while you get one that sticks a little bit. Pull that 
that out like that. Now we'll go with the uh, four tens. Okay, this is bird shot. Shoot at that can down to the left. He's gonna kind of poke out of there. Brass one kind of stuck in there. Okay, here comes a 410 slug. I'm going to shoot at this three quarter plywood to see if it goes on through. If it'll go through three quarter plywood, it would do damage to about anything you wanted to shoot at. Okay. Now the 20 gauge, get that bottle up there on the left, and now here's this hand loaded 12 gauge can over here on the right, got rid of that, that was Pyrodex black powder. Here is a factory loaded 12 gauge, that other can on the right. And here is a 12 gauge slug. Let's try for that other water bottle up there. Bullseye. So there, that's a lot of cartridges in a short amount of time. Here I just wanted to show the shots including the 44 Magnum, 45 ACP and the shotgun slugs all penetrated the plywood very well.